Hi, this is Denise Wakeman, your online visibility mentor. I want to share with you eight ways to drive traffic to your blog from LinkedIn. If the audience for your blog is primarily business people, then there's a good bet that they spend a lot of time on LinkedIn, the business to business networking site. I've been spending a lot more time there myself, and as I've been optimizing my profile and participating in groups more, I've discovered there are quite a few ways to get your business blog content in front of your contacts and then compelling them to click through to your site. So here are eight ways I've discovered to drive LinkedIn contacts to your blog. First, make sure that you have a link in your profile, the very minimum. Make sure to customize the label of the link rather than using the default label, My Blog. And when you're on, your, on the Edit Profile, you see that there's a little um, link there that says Edit next to Websites. You can just change the name of the site. Number two, auto post your blog updates to your status. You can use a social media management tool like Hootsuite uh, if you use FeedBlitz to deliver your blog updates, you can enable the option to automatically post to LinkedIn as well. You can do a, also do a search for WordPress plugins to auto post, and there are quite a few, so you'll want to pick the one that works the best for you. There are two applications you can add to your profile, the WordPress and the blog link applications. And these will, once you set them up, they'll automatically publish your recent posts to your public profile. So click on the More link up at the top, Navigation, and then click on Applications and follow the steps to add them. Set up a company profile. This is different th from your personal profile. And again, uh, you, if you look for Company Profile, there's an area there where you can syndicate your blog feed. Join groups. If you're a member of any LinkedIn groups in your niche, post links to relevant blog posts in the discussion forum. Now, a thing to note, you want to check the guidelines for the group. Some groups consider this overt prom promotion and they don't allow it. Now, I just set up a group for business owners to help boost their visibility on the web, so I encourage group members to share their content. But that's just the difference between me and other groups. So check first before you do that. Number six. Start your own group focused on your expertise. As I'm learning, this is by far the most powerful way to use LinkedIn. I've actually been going through Lewis Howe's LinkedIn Influence program, and I've picked up a lot of great tips from him. With your own group, you can syndicate your blog feed to post automatically on the discussion board. Members do not have this option. Now, the one caveat on, caveat on this is that when you're newsfeed picks up your blog post, it does not um, push them out in the daily digest of uh, new discussions. So you may want to, you know, this will be a personal decision whether you want to add this or not. I actually manually post my new blogs, uh, my new blog post to my LinkedIn group rather than having it done automatically. Uh, number seven, this is super important. Make sure you have a LinkedIn share button on your blog posts. Not only can you use it to quickly share your new articles, but your readers can as well. The powerful part of this button is that in one step you can share your status, uh, share your post to your status bo box and to any groups you're a member of, if it's okay, remember. So this is a, this is a really fast, simple way to get your, your content up on LinkedIn. Then uh, the final way to get your blog posts out to members of LinkedIn, your contacts, is that um, use the answers feature. So answer questions in the answers section, and if appropriate, include a link to a blog post that specifically addresses the question you're answering. So you can see here where the little red arrow is that um, I answered the question, and then I put a link to more traffic tips, uh, which was the um, subject of this question. So that's it. I love to know what you think. It's your turn. How do you use, you use LinkedIn to attract people to your blog? If you'd like more tips like these about boosting your visibility on the web, you can get a free e-course with seven simple implement tips at boostyourvisibility.com. Until next time, this is Denise Wakeman. Blog on!